I am the way, I am, I am the truth. Yeah, the yeah. Incorporate... I, I agree, I agree with that. You know I agree? None shall, none shall have eternal life except through him. Through him. And we agree. So all the prophets, all the prophets, through them will have eternal life. What's eternal life? No, what, what's, what's eternal life? What's eternal life? Do you know what's eternal life? Okay. Eternal life is like we say paradise. Yeah? So, at the time of Moses, Moses... No, not too much, because it's very simple for me. Okay. Uh, let me, allow me... You, but you mentioned all the prophets, okay? Allow no, me no, to... No, there seems to be, no, no, please, my, I have a very simple knowledge. I'm not, you know, into... Surprise. Allow me to... Yeah, but, but, but let me finish my question. Uh, I'm a very simple guy, keep it simple for me. I'm not into semantics or politics, I have no great knowledge. But the phrase... Um, um, uh, um, you can only come through me. You get, you know, uh, the first I, I, I mentioned earlier, John, John, I think, 14. He said through me. But there, isn't there a contradiction when you say all the prophets? All the prophets and where Jesus, and then con uh, contradicting what Jesus said, you uh, can only come to God through me. I am the way, I am the truth, and the life. You can't come through any other. Okay? But hearing your argument earlier, I seem to perceive, uh, that, correct me if I'm wrong, you are making a distinction between our Lord Jesus Christ and God. And you seem to be suggesting that they are two separate entities. Is that right? Uh, yeah, have you found the verse yet? Uh, yeah, yeah, I will, I will get you the verse, yeah. Just bear with me one second, I need to do something. Look. Let me answer him. Yeah, yes, yes. let me answer you. But did you understand? My allow question? me to. Yeah, I understood your question, okay, but just allow me to answer. I will, but I want to make sure you've understood. Because yeah. I seem to think there's a contradiction when you say all the prophets, and whereby Jesus says, "I am the way." I am okay. The truth allow the me. Yes. Allow please, me. Please. We believe. We believe that all the prophets, all the prophets, in their own times, in their own people, they were the means. The means that through them. Through them, people will get eternal life. Like Moses, Moses in him. I get that. Stop. Please. Okay, I understand. I, I, no, I, 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 no, it's, I, it's not fair on him. No, no, no. One more thing, because I want to. You, it's not fair on his way. Yeah. No, if it's not fair, he will say. Okay, you say all the prophets. Was John? Thank you. Was, was John a prophet at the time of Jesus Christ? Would you describe John as a prophet? At the time? Yeah, he's a prophet. Right. They so, thought so, he was. So, they thought so, he was Eli Elijah. Precisely. They thought so, he was so, Elijah. So, so did John say, "Come through me, and not through Jesus"? Because you are saying all the hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. Zachariah, Zachariah was also during that time, yeah. But, 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 but look, from all the prophets, look, look, when did when did the ministry of Jesus started? When did the ministry of Jesus started? When when did the ministry of Jesus started? Come to the point. Let's make it a point. Let's come to the point. Why did Muhammad reject Jesus Christ? Uh, well, Muhammad was 700 years after. It's a calamari. You know, you know. Allah, you know. Look, look, I'm having a nice conversation but, but with you, but I look. There needs to be a spiritual dimension to this. Uh, okay, fine. I respect you, I'll leave you. I don't see the spiritual dimension. You talk about history, you talk about great things that are. But the spiritual dimension is God, Jesus Christ, and the Holy Spirit. Oh, no, stop. Look, he is a Christian. Look, he's even got a cross in there. Come on. You know, you know, uh, let, let us let me and him stand through the Holy Spirit, okay, through the Holy, through Christ, way the truth of the life. Yep, best wishes. Uh, Alhamdulillah. That's wow. That's wow. But the book is universal, the message for everyone. And then I now have to go through. Let me get to you. You just think they have to make you read the Bible. Now, uh, what were we? Because uh, honestly, that they. Uh, uh, let me look for the uh, the passage. What were you saying? T t um, yeah, so I was basically saying that it, it's an exact word fallacy for us to assume that just because Jesus does not exactly state the proposition, I am God, therefore we can conclude that he's 
like not God or something. He can still demonstrate that he's God through other means. No, no. But you know, how about if I if, if I get you Jesus saying about himself that he's a prophet? Yeah, we believe he's a prophet. Okay, so do you believe Jesus is a prophet? Yeah. yeah. Then, then I why we disagree? Just, I don't believe he's just a prophet. No, but he is a prophet. How can God be a prophet? Not in his human form. Yeah, but listen, he's not just in his human form. You remember, he is fully divine and fully human. Yeah. You cannot just say in his human form because he's still, look, he is one who with two natures. Yeah. One who with two what's, isn't it? Okay. Yeah. Because we say nature is a what and that. So it's two two natures and one what? Yeah. Uh, uh, no, two what's gives us one who, yeah? The fully divine and fully human gives us the, uh, the Jesus. So you can't just say in, so if you say to me in his human form, that means his divine form was not with him. Well, yeah, his divine nature was not in, with him in, on earth. Well, how was it on him on earth? So, so, the, the so what is the divine? Okay, so the divine nature... Yes, not, wait, you, do, you, do you realize what you're saying? Yeah, the, the, okay, so the divine... No Christian I've ever debated said that. Okay. The divine, so I think, I think we need to take it no back. No Christian you've ever debated said that, you've not debated smart Christians. The divine nature cannot be locked to a spatial dimension. So the divine nature is pure being, it, it exists. I can't say where it exists because when I say where it exists, that presupposes that it exists in the location. Look, look. So look, but uh, let me take nature, you to John 1 1. Let me take you back to John 1 1. And the flesh and the word became yeah, the, the word, word became, became so you can't say that the divine that okay. divine was left over no, because no, no, no. the divine the divine became flesh. No, the word is a person, it's a who. Yeah, it's a who. Okay, it's a who. The who became a what? Yeah. The who, who, because so the who is already a white, so the who is already divine, isn't it? Yeah. Okay. Okay. Uh, thank you. Yeah. We should tell you before. So oh, it's quite okay. rare. So, so you know, you know, you know what it is. Mm. Mm. The divine nature, mm -hmm. the divine nature, that divine nature became into a divine. No. Okay, uh, into a human nature. The word became. Okay, yeah. so, how would you explain that? How, how okay. would you get away from this? Now, let's imagine, this is going to be an imperfect analogy, but you're very intelligent, so you'd understand it. Now, let's say, let's just imagine me with um, one hand only. Just imagine me with yeah, one yeah, arm yeah, only. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Now, teaching, I exist yeah. with one arm only, I'm S.Y. Now, let's say I create an artificial hand. It wasn't recording on time. Yeah, it's fine. Let's go. You can you can you can just put it here. It will pick up the the the, the, the DJI picks up rather well. Uh, okay, sorry about that. It's um, all right. Oh, it picks up. It picks up well. You 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 were you were giving me an analogy that you are an uh, MPT. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Thank you. No problem. So, no problem. Um, just to show you that I'm listening to you. Thank you, brother. All right. So so I have one arm, and I only have one arm. Now let's say I create an artificial arm. And okay. Right there. Yeah. And then I take on the uh, the the arm transplant, and I join it to to this yeah. arm. So now this arm is like a part of my body. It's right? it's 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 functional. Yeah. It's functional. It, it, in philosophy, we call it aptitudinal inheritance. So the the arm the arm has the aptitude to exist inside of me as a subject. So the word is a subject, and the word creates this human nature, this human flesh, and the so word. So who is the object then? Yeah, so Who the is object, the object? The human if, flesh. Huh? The human flesh is an object. But didn't didn't the subject yeah. turn himself into the object? The, the, sub, the subject commuted. So the subject. No, no, the subject became. You see, the subject became. And you cannot say became and use the. the, the uh, I think it's Aristoteles. The, 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 uh, Aristotle. Aristotle, yeah, sorry. I, I say Aristotelis because oh, I love kind of... Okay. But, uh, but, but it's him who is... Uh, the, uh, you just mentioned, I, I believe that I read for him that uh, he talks about the... Uh, the, the natures? Of the natures, yeah. yeah. So, so basically, 
We have one nature, the divine nature. That divine nature became, but, but that's what it says in the Bible. No. So, so I'm, I'm holding you to the English term, become, like when I say, and water became wine. No, yeah, okay, so. But, but, but you understand what I mean? I, so it's no longer, it's no longer water. The only thing that it will have in common with the water, it's the liquidity. Yeah. That the other one is liquid, and no, wine no, is liquid, yeah. and the other one is liquid, yeah? So that's the only thing that is to, between them. Yeah, okay? because the, the water and the wine are two objects. They're not subjects, they're not persons. Yeah, but, so, but, but one of them turned into, the, the, the wine becomes, the wine becomes the, the object of the subject. Because look, who is the doer? The doer is Jesus. Okay, yeah. The doer is Jesus, yeah? So he is the doer. Yeah. He's the subject. Uh -huh. The, the, the both, the water and the wine, were objects. Yeah. Well, because because the, the interference of Jesus yeah. turned the, the water into wine. Yeah. In the same way, the divine nature took on itself, no. took on itself. Yeah. The, reason why, the reason why we have to make this exception is because why? Divine, when, when, we, when we predicate or when we index change, we're indexing change just to the human nature alone. Because the divine nature cannot change. How? How can you have it's, that? It's called a mixed relation. So, for example, Allah created the world. Allah created uh, the universe. Yes. The universe is dependent on Allah, but Allah is not dependent on the universe. Yeah, I know that. But Allah is not that. dependent on the universe. But, but you say. But, so there's but a mixed then, relation there. Okay. So now, is the flesh still divine or not? The flesh divine? No. What? How? If, what? Look. If it's a, it's a divine person in the flesh. Look! 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 look. You have got Jesus. Yeah. In order to have Jesus, we have to have the two natures. We have to have the two natures. No. How, how no? Jesus can exist without his human nature. No, no, look, look. We have, we have Jesus. We have Jesus, yeah? yeah. And we have, and we, Jesus has to be fully divine and fully human. Fully Jesus, divine and fully human. Jesus can exist without his human nature. Without his As human nature? God. Yeah, he can. No, but, but he's not Jesus, is he? He's the Word, remember? He is the Word. No. He is the Word. We only call him Jesus Christ because that's the name that's given to us when he came in human flesh. Yeah, so, so when he came in human flesh. So the divine came in human flesh. So the, the, the divine, divine nature, no. The person, yes. Okay, the, the so, so, so when, 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 when the Holy Spirit hovered over oh, Mary, over Mary. Oh, over Mary. No, 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 I'm not talking about Genesis. I'm not talking about, uh, I'm talking, I'm talking about, and uh, by the way, that some of them, they say uh, uh, Rauch, Rauch, which is in Hebrew also means wind. Okay. So, 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 Ruch Kudus, Ruch Kudus, Ruch Kudus, that's why it's uh, the Holy Spirit. Okay. So, the Holy Spirit hovered over Mary and she conceived. Okay? You agree on that? Yeah. So the divine, the divine was in the womb. No. So where was the divine? Okay, so when we say that the Holy Spirit affected Mary, uh, quote unquote, hovered yeah. over Mary. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're, we're talking about the operation of the Holy Spirit. So, so what was, what, 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 how, how did she conceive? So the Holy Spirit operated in Mary, but the Holy Spirit's nature was not in Mary's body. So for example, there's two ways something can be somewhere. But let me just give you oh, okay. okay. So Aquinas, Thomas Aquinas uh, uh, illustrates how two, there's two ways something can be present. So something can be present physically, like I'm pre physically yeah. talking to you. Yeah. And something can be present by operation. So let's say, for example, you send me to the shops over there and I'm buying something. You're still present with me in some sense. Because the only reason why I'm in that shop and buying something is because of your command. You sent me there. The same is that's called being that's called uh, being present by operation. So the Holy Spirit was present in Mary by operation. He operated with it within her divinely, but his nature, he was not physically in her body. No. Because the Holy Spirit and his divine nature cannot be indexed to uh, a spatial realm. That's gonna but, but you up. know, but you know that the Holy Spirit was in the was in the womb of uh, the uh, the mother of uh, of uh, J uh, John the Baptist. Not circumscriptively, though. No, uh, <laughs> Sorry, can you? It's never going to be location. Can you? Can you? Uh, okay, right. Yeah, I know you are you are his friend, but just give us, okay. please. Yeah. 
Okay, so, yeah. so you got Christian cameras by the way, or are these beamers? There's one Christian. Okay. Cool. I, I don't as long as you got one. So, so what I'm saying is, so that the Holy Spirit already existed in the womb of the mother of uh, John the Baptist. So it's 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 known. It's a known fact. No, the the Holy Spirit existed by operation, not physically. Not physically, no. Are you sure? I'm very sure. I can. Now, you you see, once you said that Jesus is a prophet, and that's why I said to you before, John 17:1, 17, 17:3. 17, yeah, you this is eternal only. life. No, this is eternal life. They should worship your only. Well, this is the Lord. eternal life yeah. that they may know you as the only true God yeah. and Jesus Christ whom you've sent yeah? yeah so the only true God the word in Greek is monos mm -hmm. monos mm -hmm. and monos means only exclusivity yeah exclusivity so who is the only true God the only true God is the Trinity yes yeah. no Jesus the second the second I allow me just order. allow me yeah and then you can counter it okay. but allow me to to uh, so According to Christ, according to Jesus Christ, in John 17, 3, the only true God, the monos, the monos theos, is the Father. Is the Father. And Jesus Christ whom you sent. So we now in here that the only true, true God is the Father. He didn't say, he didn't say the only true God I mean, what would stop Jesus, peace be upon him, of saying, of saying, I am the only true God, is me, the Father, and the, and, and, uh, the Holy, uh, uh, Holy Spirit, the Holy Ghost? I mean, you can argue that he does indicate in Matthew 28, 19, when he said, baptize in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Yeah, that, I mean, that's that what I said to you, triadic, have... triadic, not three as in one, but oh. in the name, of no, no, no. the father but, 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 but the reason why it can't be triadic though is because he's putting the, the son and the holy spirit on the same divine status as the father no because the only reason why the sacrament works the, i mean in, in christian sacramental theology the only reason why baptism works is if you invoke <laughs> Why are you people childish? Huh? Why are you childish? Because you guys keep running away from a debate. Yeah, it, it doesn't want to it's debate childish. him. It doesn't want to debate him. Why? Because you guys keep lying. It's, it's, a, free, it's a free country, isn't it? Yeah, well, why come here it's a free country, lie? yeah? Don't come here to spread lies. Jesus Christ is Lord. Look, it's been a pleasure talking to you. We'll try another time, yeah? yeah. Another nice, time, nice yeah? Nice yeah, no problem. Yeah. You see, like, not like the other time this time i've spoke to you I, i'm i will always speak to you yeah. as soon as we respect each other yeah. and i'm um, anyway you look after yourself you until next time yeah thanks very much thank, thank you for you much. having time with me yeah thank you